Hey ladies and gents, DC team makes here, back on the old Cushman. Um, progress, uh, we have a new air handmade air filter to fit that GX670 um, carb. Um, I know it doesn't have exactly the same volume, but here we go. Straight off, no hesitation, best it's ever run. Hot both sides, woohoo! There you go. <laughs> That's only taken two years. <laughs> what a joke. Uh, anyway, so what we're doing now is I've just taken all of this junk off that was uh, holding a beam at the back. Um, <laughs> stupid arrangement. Because I didn't have the uh, RAM and any of the hydraulics for this. Um, I decided to, just as we were moving some dirt and stuff, to put a uh, small winch on that went up oh, oh, point like up to about here over a pulley back down and picked the back of the bed up and it just hoisted it up it lifted the bed full of clay and dirt no problem uh, obviously this is just temporary so what, what I'm doing now is I am going to take the winch off and reroute all the electrics for the wrench back down all the way down here and we're going to actually put the winch on the front here on this beam at the front and then to lift the bed because I have a restricted headroom on the shed that where the Cushman is so I'm not putting that beam back on that was part of the problem as well as I might have left it because it was working real well is uh, to actually uh, put an electric trailer lift in it a 3500 pound trailer lift way more than it's needed but there's that guy yeah it's hard to freight giving it a shot we'll see um, that will go the base will come out the pin It'll swivel, and I don't know if you can see it, maybe, down there, there is a pin layout right here, where I'll drop that, I'll move these out and drop those in there, and then it'll come up and it'll join onto the, the back of the actual bed, yeah, and then we'll be able to lift it up and down, it doesn't have to go up very far just enough to make it easier at our age <laughs> to move dirt out of it instead of having to uh, shovel it all out again put it in there and then shovel it out do it move it all twice so this will make it easier plus uh, moving some of the debris around the property you know logs and stuff okay well that's just a quick update as you heard straight off start um, idles beautiful um, uh, for the <laughs> For the uh, pathway that this has taken to get to this point, that is absolutely marvelous. Um, you guys want any information on this particular change? That's the GX670 carb, and then just a kind of a handmade filter arrangement for now because of the limited kind of headroom here up underneath the chair. Uh, it was actually touching the factory one, so that was no good. Um, give me a shout on that. Uh, you want to know about anything about this arrangement for Cushman's and anything else direct drive instead of you know of some kind of pulley arrangement um, give me a shout uh, that's it for now you guys uh, stay safe wash your hands subscribe click thumbs up share see ya bye